हे गाइज वॉट्स आप बैक विद अनदर वीडियो सो टूडे इज द डे वेन आई एम फाइनली 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 गोइंग टू जेरूसलम ओ माई फ्रीकिन Lord, if you all know, I came to Israel about one year, four months ago, and I didn't really get a chance to go visit Jerusalem. So I am on my way to Jerusalem on a food truck festival. Oh my God! Who knew I would be going to the holy city for food? <laughs> so if you don't know about Jerusalem, it is. one of the oldest cities in the world it's also called as the holy city it is israel's capital and it's the most beautiful city and a lot of people visit jerusalem for tours and pilgrims because it's so beautiful and the vibe is crazy so i'm going to take you there with me and today on this journey i have another friend from australia who's joining me and i will shortly introduce her to you guys but before we get into this video don't forget to like share subscribe and hit that bell icon to receive notifications whenever i upload a new video do you see that that is the timing for buses we have an app but this also gives like an accurate timing for when the buses are going to arrive You have money here. Ah, uh, okay. If you have money here, you see, you have money here. Right. One hundred eight fifty. Knock on. Now we can go in. Here you go. Okay. Oh. So that. Wow, that guy was so nice when I told him I am filming for my YouTube. He said, "I will demonstrate for you," and he did it. People are really nice here. And I am on my way to platform number three because we are going to board the train now. for the train to start it starts at like 6:31 masha my friend she's going to board from tel aviv i hope she finds me because she asked me to board from a compartment that she wants me to but i am not sure if i'm in the right compartment i am so happy that the train is empty there are hardly any people in my compartment and i know it will fill as in when it travels towards tel aviv because today is thursday and people will want to go home and it's also rush hour but let's hope <laughs> that the train goes khali i had creme brulee in office before i left i know i shouldn't have but i was like chalna kha lete then it was like सात आठ बजे तो पहुँच जाएंगे तब तक तो बहुत भूख लग जाएगी और फिर मुझे तो इरिटेशन हो जाती है अगर बहुत ही भूख लग जाती है और खाना नहीं मिलता तो सावत लाइक चल थोड़ा खा लेते हैं बट आई एम फीलिंग गिल्टी इतना सारा शुगर खा लिया मैंने बट ठीक है वन से ना वाइड इट्स फाइन है ना people in a long time 
Wow. That's massive. That's three of them. What? <laughs> And it's beautiful. How do you feel right now? Very holy. <laughs> Kotel. Kotel is the western wall where the Jews from all around the world come in and pray and put their chits in the wall for them to come true. I kid you not, since the time I've entered Jerusalem, it's been a different vibe altogether. I can feel the energy. It's insane. You guys have to come here if you all plan to visit Israel. It has to be on your checklist. So I've written a couple of wishes for myself that I wish to achieve for this year. I remember the last time I was here in 2016 when I came on Taglit from India. It was a different experience back then because I had just come to visit as a tourist and I was exploring as a tourist and now I live in this country. I remember the goals that I put in or the wishes that I put in were completely different than I put now. Now we are going to be heading towards the food truck festival. Introducing to you my beautiful friend from Australia. Good night. <laughs> What's your favorite color? Orange. Do you love me? Yes. <laughs> Can you quickly narrate the story of how we started to speak? Okay, so Rev posted on Facebook, said on like a group I'm in, and she was like, hey, I miss like Indian culture and Indian friends. Um, and I was like, ooh, this is cool. She's Indian. <laughs> so I go and stalk her profile and see that she's like a Bollywood dancer. She seems super cool. So I messaged her and I said, I'm sorry that I'm not Indian, I'm white, but can we still be friends? <laughs> and she replied, yes. So now we're friends. <laughs> and I think that was the best decision ever because we have gotten to be really good friends now. Yes. What's your favorite Israeli dish? Shakshuka. Okay, that's my favorite too. We have so much in common. Yes. What's your favorite Israeli word? I, I kind of made up a word myself. Okay. It's a baba ganoush. Okay, can you explain? Baba is, it just means like all good. 
Okay. And Baba Ganoush is a, it's like a Middle Eastern dip of like smoked eggplant. So I like to combine them. And they like some Baba Ganoush. So Baba Ganoush Chaim Shali. One last question. Choose one. Russian boys, Israeli boys, Australian boys. Israeli boys, hands down. <laughs> <laughs> Pizza and Marsha, of course. Hi. Pizza, what? Pizza crusted. Now, dig in. Yummy. Yeah, it's delicious. Yum. <laughs> Quick update, Masha is taking us on a hike up the stairs. <laughs> up the stairs. Hana Vishona to Silo. It's like this cool like bar and it has some dessert. Yala!
on my way back home we are super 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 tired we were initially going to go only to the kotel and then followed by food truck festival but we ended up exploring more i love these spontaneous plans but we were super tired because today was thursday we both of us worked all day and then we left for jerusalem but i promise i will take you guys again hopefully for an entire day and take you to other spots because jerusalem is a beautiful city and there's so much to explore also in terms of food like local local food thank you for watching don't forget to like share subscribe and hit that bell icon to receive notifications whenever i upload a new video okay bye